Good traveling next time. Corvo. Yes, yes. The pressure was too low. Hello. Corvo, you're back. Will you tell me about your trip, please? Were there any whales? Wait. Let's play hide and seek first. I'll cover my eyes and you hide. You have time? Mother's busy talking to that nasty old spy master. Okay, here we go. Corvo? Welcome home, Lord Protector. Stop moving, Campbell. Let's go. Come on. <laughs> Let's see if you're so good at this. I'll hide my eyes and count, and at the end of the countdown, I'll try and find you. Okay, I'm going to count to ten. Find a place to hide. Okay, you win. We should go now, so Mother can see you too. Uh... Uh... Later, will you give me more climbing lessons? Someday I'm going to climb up to the rooftop. Did you see any monsters while traveling to the other aisles? My nanny says the big ocean is full of... She'll see you at once. They're sick people, not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, Your Majesty. They're... They're my citizens, and we will save them from the plague if we can. All of them. Very well. We will not speak of this again. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Leave us, please. As you wish, Your Majesty. Corvo. Two days early, full of surprises, as usual. It's a fair wind that Follow brings me, you home Captain. to me. What you news have you brought? Them. I hoped that one of the other cities had dealt with this before, knew of some cure. This news is very bad. We're at the breaking point. Cowards. They're going to blockade us. They'll wait to see if the plague turns the city into a graveyard. Are you okay, Mother? You seem sad. Yes, don't worry, darling. Mother is fine. Wait, where are the guards? Who sent them away? Mother, look! What are they doing on the rooftop? What? Emily, come here! Of 
Corvo, thank you. If you hadn't been here... No more! Not again! Mommy! No! Get away from her! Corvo! Emily, protect her. You're the only one. You'll know what to do, won't you? Corvo. Ward us all. Look at what he's done. Yes, he's killed the Empress. What did you do with young Lady Emily, traitor? Her own bodyguard. Ironic. I'll see you beheaded for this, Corvo. Peg him. Chance, Corvo. Sign the confession and let me give you the rights to put your spirit at ease. Ah! Ah! <sighs> That's enough for now. Get out. Let's give the man some time to think. Corvo, the Empress is dead. Her daughter Emily is hidden away, and no one will ever know the truth. Yes, unlucky you. Tomorrow you'll be executed, but it's for a good cause. This country needs strong leadership now, someone to guide the weak. And that's where we come in. There was nothing personal in this, even though you almost sank our plans. But it turned out well. You were in the wrong place the right time, and someone has to take the fall. Goodbye, Corvo. Guards! Take him back to his cell. 